Well, now Singapore and China's Shandong province will continue to boost collaboration in key areas like trade and connectivity, modern services and sustainable development. Senior Minister of State for Trade and Industry, Chi Hong Tut, highlighted this, these priority areas at the 21st Singapore Shandong Business Council meeting. And he said that against the current global economic environment, both sides need to reaffirm their commitment to global trade. He says this will show how like-minded partners can work together for win-win outcomes. Geraldine Yap with more. Singapore supply chain management company YCH is expanding into Shandong province with its new logistics park set to open in Tsingtao in 2021. The company is no stranger to China, having been there for more than 20 years. The idea is to be able to not just to bring in advanced uh, supply chain management, also to bring in our supply chain and logistics academy, which is training for the industry here in Singapore. We intend to bring that in to be able to use that platform to actually also build up the skills that's necessary for Shandong, for Qingdao to grow in that kind of a value chain. Senior Minister of State for Trade and Industry, Chi Hong Tat, cited YCH as an example of how Singapore firms can help build Shandong's infrastructure to facilitate trade flows. A total of 12 agreements were signed, including one between Enterprise Singapore and the Qingdao Municipal Government to facilitate partnerships in areas like innovation and connectivity. Mr Chi said Singapore and Shandong will also strengthen collaboration in modern services like financing, listing and legal advisory. Shandong companies looking to expand into Singapore and beyond can tap into such services through a new business services platform set to launch by the first half of next year. Mr Chi also highlighted sustainable sustainable development as a third area of collaboration. This is a priority for both Shandong and the Singapore government. And in particular for heavy industries, how do we help them to be more efficient, more sustainable, and um, how do we then develop urban solutions and also engineering solutions that can help our companies to be more environmentally friendly. He added both sides will also continue to provide opportunities for student exchanges between Singapore and Shandong.